not much to talk about right now. It looks like going to Battlefield, facial not taking out the headphones. If not, if he is, they're not out yet. Okay, so okay, man, Battlefield. Um, he wants to go to Yoshi's or Dreamland. I bet. All right, strikes Yoshi's. Okay, strikes Yoshi's because he know he probably knows that uh, Koopa likes the stage the most. So. All right, best out of five. Winner of this gets to play Squid. And here we go. So time to see what nuance has in it in this matchup, as I'm gonna have to learn it. So I know, I'm pretty sure that she can convert off, she can Mario both to convert off a down throw against each other. And so, Koopa Trooper tries to approach, gets walled out by Sheik's F tilt, and then gets punished by a fair, respectively. Uh, tries a hard read, facial going low for the ledge, but okay. Wow, okay. So the thing that was important there was that uh, with Mario's forward smash, you can actually angle it. So what Koopa Trooper did was he angled it up so that it would hit facial. If he angled it straight or down, it probably would not have hit at all. Alright, he attempts to DI mix up, gets punished, and that is, as a result, I think that is. It depends. Okay, I, I'm skeptical of that was going to ever work in the in this universe. But so facial can't punish, and then Mario just gets the down throw tech chase. I mean, just the down throw chain grabs. So it's difficult on the stage due to the platforms. They can go lower than you expect. You know, with the with how random they get. Okay. So at a certain percent, the cape does just knock him straight up and it sends him to hit stun. I, I believe you can tech it, but it's, it's highly unexpected. Okay, goes all the way out there, tries to hard, hard reads uh, facial recovery. Good DI on that F smash, so... Yeah, I feel like Sheik should know at that... When Sheik, like, Sheik is a bag of tricks, so when Sheik tries to go for certain things, I think definitely either, if you don't know all of them through experience, one should be able to know what Sheik wants to do, depending on the, how they up B before, you know, they do, there's two phases of the up B, right? They go up, and then they explode, and then they teleport to another place. If you can read what Sheik does on the first phase of the up B, then you should be solid. What? He tried to wall jump that, I don't know if you meant to do that. Some of these decisions by Facial I question. So, probably has good intentions, just I mean, probably the wrong read. Fair? I feel like up air would have killed. Wow! Okay, that was. Koopa sweet spot of that. Facial probably could have died. Wow. Hard read. Oh, all these hard reads are just crazy. Man, Koopa is a solid player. I don't know why this man hasn't been ranked yet. I've been definitely grabbing ledge would have been better there. So just grab ledge, go up, F smash. Yep, that's how it is. Okay, so he grabs, he hits face roll in the middle of the recovery. Well timed by Koopa Troopa. Unfortunate SD, no one wants to see that. We oh, take those. Okay, fair to turn around re grab. I felt that face roll could have buffered rolled out of it, but I'm not sure. Wow, okay. The poor DI on that down smash. He's going back on stage, he's- oh! I, he didn't angle that up, I think. Alright, this should be it for Sheik, yep. That's it, solid game one. Looks like we're going to probably Dreamland. Yeah, we have to go to Dreamland. Okay. Koopa Troopa composing himself. Okay, we're going to Battlefield. Let's see. Okay, uppies to try to break out of the shield pressure. Wow. 
Wow, okay, that was sick. So he, what Facial did was needle, and then he landed on the ground, either from a needle cancel, I'm not sure, but he did a turn around, wave dash, grab ledge. Very quick to execute, so that's something that Sheik players should practice. Okay, yeah, so that was a good retreating fair by Facial. If he committed and did the fair and landed on the stage, that uh, Koopa's down smash would have hit. Wow, okay, so Koopa's just trying to hard read. I, I don't know if he's getting a little, probably getting a little greedy, just trying to hard read Facial's approaches with the raw F smash. Well, I mean, that edge guard worked. Who am I to complain then? Oh. Wow. I thought that Mario would have been would have been able to grab ledge there. I was surprised. E, that's is that it? Nope. Okay. Koopa misses the fair, which would have converted into a F smash. I think wave dash grab would have been better. Wow. All these all these S matches, I'm just so surprised that they're hitting, but you know, I'm I'm even more surprised that you know I'm more I'm surprised that Koopa's doing them. I'm more surprised that he's still hitting a uh, face roll with them. Reflex and needles, but they don't they don't last long enough to hit face roll. Excellent shield drop up air there. Did convert. Push Facial off to the side of the stage, but unfortunately now Facial regains center stage control. Alright, so the, if you expect the one two punch coming from Mario and you crowd cancel it or shield, it's not that great anymore, so. You can say that Facial got you know all this damage on just because Koopa Troopa messed up and decided to one-two punch and they got crouch canceled. But it's a one-to-one -one game right now, so I do expect Facial to take the stock. Okay, down throw. Okay, so okay, F throw was that an accident? I felt like the guaranteed down throw would have been better. Wow, good DI on Koopa Troopa. Uh, if he DI'd it in I guess or technically away from the stage it would have been straight up and that would have been you know more that would have been dead for Koopa Troopa. The fair I mean the up air would have definitely killed. Probably going to final destination. That's my I guess. So Sheik's recovery being bad you know there's no platforms and then that's just free chain throwing for Koopa Troopa. But Mario's so floaty enough that she can't exactly chain throw Mario to that high of a percent. So, yeah, the expected pick, final destination. So. All right, Fair has enough hit sun for you to grab after. That's that's nice to know. Well, right. nope, we can't shield grab that F smash. I think. Now Facial knows that. He tried it twice and now uh, he's convinced that that didn't work on the Tipper F Smash and the Sour Spot F Smash. Alright, wrong way to on the B. Good concept though, good idea. Sorry guys, it's been a long day, long weekend, but... So at this percentage, she can probably kill off, you know, up air. Yeah. The one thing that people over, most people overlook is when they can die from an up air, because most people try to expect the horizontal punish, i.e. Nair, Bear, or Fair. Right? They don't realize how high of a percent they are for on the for the up air. Then they just you know they di like straight above Sheik and then they get hit by it. 
One just has to look at the percentage. Wow, so that S smash was surpri surprising. Did not hit the sheet, but did hit the needle. Alright, this looks like a solid win for facial on this game, but you know, can't count out Shuba yet. Uh, okay, so the fireballs do prevent face roll from running in and that essentially secured the kill for Koopa Troopa. Alright, yep. Tries to full hop over Sheik for some reason with that. It doesn't look like he had a plan at all and then Sheik just up tilted and got 65%. Wow, okay. So, DIing in, I believe, on the Mario up tilt uh, led to more... Wow. This is unfortunate. I don't think... I think we're going to Yoshi's. Uh, so we went to Fountain, we went to Battlefield, Final. Yeah, we should be going to Yoshi's. Unless if Koopa thinks that he can do it on Final, because Final is the best pick for this matchup on textbook. But, alright, we're running it back. Okay, so Facial calls out the Koopa approach by just raw grabbing him. Alright, so now the chain throws are coming. Uh, Koopa, unfortunately, wow. Okay. So, DI'd in on every single hit, I believe. So, it did prevent his death, but I feel like if he DI'd out on the up air, he would definitely could have taken a lot less percent. I wonder if this is optimal, doing that uh, quick, you know, going down or sideways and then up being instead of shield stalling. Griffin really pushes Sheik to new levels. Oh, okay. Koopa had that idea. He thought that... Wow. Koopa thought that Facial would go back to the ledge, but nope. Not falling for it. Oh, that's a weird end down air placement. I was not ready for that from Facial. Official just trying to get extra damage on there to put Mario into that, you know, down throw edge guard situation. 74 is still a decent amount of damage. If he gets a grab, it's definitely knocking Mario off the stage. The invincible ledge dash. Wow. Wow. Okay, 46%. That's unanswered percent just because of the chain grabs. So. Oh, I think that was an F smash. Okay, gets the sour spot reverse F smash. Something I've rarely seen in my life. Okay. So Koopa needs to bring this back together. I feel like he's just getting hit by unnecessary necessary things. Now that Koopa's... Wow, that, that punish was pretty sick considering how floaties are. You know, and cheap Mario. You know, she can't get the super long string on Mario, but uh, that that was a solid 30 to 40 percent. Griffin misses that follow up on the down throw fair. Right. Wow. Okay. So catches the Sheik in the middle of the humpy. Wow. Okay. Yeah. So I guess that isn't safe. I'm not sure how to feel. I think that Facial should just stop doing that. It just looks cool. Not much value in it. Good DI on the F Smash. Does find that corner for maximum survival. Ooh, I think whoever... Okay, whoever gets his next stock... Okay, so... Yeah, Griffin's a little bit relieved, but now he's just trying really hard to, to just, you know, get... Koopa in some sort of combo here. Wow, okay, if Koopa got that grab, that would have been a backdoor to death. Absolutely. Okay, so Facial wisely going after the down throw after an up air, I mean an up tilt, and not following up after that because Koopa could have definitely followed up with maybe a nair or some other attack. Alright. Oh, no, I don't know why he keeps doing that. It's not safe. I think a bear would have been safer. Maybe he's just trying something new. I don't know. I'll ask the facial about it later. It might be some frame data thing. <laughs> di a good di. Facial attempted to di out, but then di in on the. Wow. 
dead in on that that smash, so what is it going to oh, okay. I maybe I'll smash and kill there. Down okay, that was an odd angle. That was a very good angle. Uh, wow. Wow, okay, he got it, so we're going to game five. That was just a down throw, running jump canceled up smash. Survive longer, and then she gets a good, better recovery on this, those higher side platforms of Dreamland. If Koopa were to grab ledge, she would need to have, you know, either predict it or he would have to have a sick ledge dash to some follow up when she comes to that side platform. So both of these players have played, um, both of these players did play Squid, so one of them is eagerly waiting for this rematch. You notice these players are smart on knowing uh, how how long hit stun is for certain attacks. So facial commits to certain moves, but in this moment he chose not to commit uh, to some back airs because he knows that Koopa can hit him out of it. Hit out for DR on that smash. Wow. Okay. Good trick out by facial. Looking like he went, it was gonna go for that side platform, but actually went a little bit under. Then forcing KT Koopa Troopa just to, to react differently. It gets cut by that up beat. Oh, so Koopa Troopa tries to up B, gets met with needles. So it seems like Koopa Troopa is playing a lot really defensively right now. He's trying to bait face roll to go in with some you know, some random approach and getting caught with maybe an up tilt and then Koopa's gonna convert off that. Wow, that was... I don't think that was a hard read that he would grab before the Mario F smash, but Griffin made it work out. Okay, that was the farthest... Wow, okay, I didn't think that Facial will be able to get that. That was a sick jumped short hop fade back fair that I did not think that would work. If that were most other Sheiks, I felt like that would have been uh, a, you know, the fair going the other way. But I think the reason why face roll is recovering high with up B is because I, I don't know. I, I, I was trying to justify in some outlandish way by that, you know, Koopa Troopa or Mario can't deal with the random fake back from Sheik. Uh, I, I feel like on textbook it's just a lot better, you know, just to do the standard recovery and not up be so high. Well, see, generic defensive moves, but, you know, Sheik does have those generic defensive moves of her own. Alright, so fist bump, good set, Koopa Troopa getting third, respectable run. And now we have the rematch of Squid versus